You can see houses, rivers, farms, cities, cars, and lots of trees. As the cow got closer to the mountains, Uncle Sleep said, you folks will probably fall here, but Aunt Hale and the kids and I are going a bit further north. We'll see you all in a couple of weeks. Bye, said Cousin Frost and Snowflake. Bye, said Little Drop and Little Sister Drop. They're all gonna go to different places because some, the cold ones, Sleep, Hale, and Snowflake, they're all gonna go to the cold mountain. Wait a minute, Daddy Drop, said Little Drop. Uncle Sleep just said, did he just say he's gonna fall? Yes, Little Drop, but it's not gonna hurt. Remember, this is all part of the great water cycle. We're about to become part of rain. This is how we get back to our ocean that we love. Little Drop started to shiver. Little Sister Drop started to shiver too. She said, it's cold around here. When we get cold, the sky cannot hold us any longer and we get to fall as rain, said Daddy Drop. Then it happened. I wonder what happened. What do you think happened, Moshe? They were raining down. Let's find out. Oh, they fell. Little drop, little sister drop, daddy drop, and mommy drop fell out of the sky. They were now rain. Down, down they fell. Little drop plopped onto the leaf of an oak tree, slid up to the edge, and fell some more. Splish! Little Drop fell into a puddle under a tree. Splash! Little Drop fell right beside him. Where are Daddy and Mommy Drop? Little Sister Drop asked. I don't know, Little Sister Drop. Let's swim to that creek and find them, said Little Drop. They held hands and swam from the puddle into the creek. The creek was babbling along quite happily down the hill. It made Little Drop and Little Sister Drop smile. They babbled right along with the creek. As they made their way through the hillside, they saw all kinds of creatures, deers and squirrels and beavers. All of those animals live around the water. It wasn't long until their little creek joined the river. There was lots and lots of other drops in the water, but none of them were daddy and mommy drop. As they went down river, they saw houses and people fishing. There were even some small boats. We're so lucky in Florida, we get to see all kinds of water around us. We see lakes, we can see the intercoastal, and even the ocean and swimming pools. We see so much water in Florida. All of a sudden, Little Drop and Sister Drop were sucked into the opening of the side of the river. It was a pipe that led to a water pump. Around and around they swirled in the pump, and they were pushed at super high speed through another long pipe. Oh no, where are they going? <sighs> Splish, splash, Little Drop and Little Sister Drop fell out of the kitchen faucet and into a sink full of dirty dishes. Whee! Yelled Little Drop as they played up and down the dishes. Little Sister Drop enjoyed it just as much as Little Drop did. After all the dishes were cleaned, the plug was pulled from the sink and a whirlpool, whirlpool formed in the sink. Round and around and around went Little Drop and Little Sister Drop. They slid down the drain and down through more and more pipes. It was like the longest water slide in the world. Finally, they came out of the pipe and were dumped back into the river. There were the boats. There were the docks for the boats. There were more people pushing. Wow, what's gonna happen? Oh, After a couple more days, they drifted past the very tall lighthouse standing watch over the entrance to a harbor. Little Drop and Little Sister Drop were back in the big ocean. A wave splashed nearby. It was Daddy Drop. There was Mommy Drop, too. Oh, Little Drop was so happy to see his parents again. They looked behind them, and there was Uncle Sleet, Anna Hill, and his cousins Frost and Snowflake. They were all together again in the big ocean. I was afraid I would never see you again, Little Drop told Daddy Drop. Oh, Little Drop. Don't ever be afraid, reassured Daddy Drop. It's just part of the Great Water Cycle. Whenever we go through the Great Water Cycle, we always come back here. If we get separated, sooner or later, we will all see each other again. From that day on, Little Drop looked forward to the sun warming him and sending him high up into the sky. He was always excited to be part of the Great Water Cycle. <laughs> Little Drop had many, many more adventures in the Great Water Cycle. The end. All right, guys. So, yeah, absolutely. So today we 
we are gonna make a wind and rain project together. So you should all have a piece of white paper that got a little blue on the end because some of the blue spilled on it. Right, do you all have that? Okay, and you should have a cup of water that turned blue so we can all see it. A spoon and, and spear glue. That's right. And a straw. straw. And you should have a piece of paper that on the other side are shape of rain boots. These are rain boots. A spoon. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna open our rain and we're gonna make it rain gently onto our paper with the spoon. So Moshe, you wanna take out some of the rain and make it rain onto the paper. You can make it rain. Woo, rain! Okay, good, now, good, you made it rain, excellent. And now you're gonna blow it around like the wind. I want you to blow it around the paper, but not on me. Okay, blow, blow, good, blow it around. Go closer, you go close to your thing and blow, blow, blow. Blow, hard. There you go, all right, blow. Oh, there it goes. Water's going everywhere. You see his water moving? There you go. Good, keep flowing. Turn your page, keep flowing. We're gonna make a big puddle, a big puddle with our rain. Good, blow, go close and blow really, really hard. Good, there you go. You see Moshe blowing it? That looks amazing. Good, the wind comes and it blows the water all over the place. Everyone's is gonna look completely different because you're all gonna blow it. Okay, Moshe, when you've floated all over the paper, it's time to cut out our boots, our rain boots, because our rain boots are gonna splash in here. So you want to be ready to cut out your rain boots? Want to use the big marm? Yeah. Okay. Moshe's gonna cut out the rain boots. Everybody watch Moshe as he cuts out his rain boots. Yeah. All right, Moshe's cutting them out. Everybody can see Moshe? There he goes, he's cutting on the lawn. Oh, hello, good morning, Wonder Woman. Yeah, you're looking a lot like Wonder Woman this morning. Where's your L? Cut out. I can't hear you. Where's your L? Yomo, let's go, your class is starting. Starting, we're almost done. Oh, okay. we're just starting. <laughs> Hi, Al. Moshe is cutting out his rain boots. Wait, what time is this class? I thought it's at 11. Manny, are you cutting out your rain boots? Yeah. What? Did I miss your class? It's recorded. You can always watch it again. Got it. Perfect. Okay, we'll call you back. Yeah. We'll just watch the recording. Oh, Jacob, good cutting. Really well, good cutting. Okay, so we, I'll watch. Yeah, you can, we keep it up. Ah, yeah, first okay, rainbow. first rainbow, you wanna glue it on in your puddle? You're gonna, okay. yeah. And then we're gonna glue it on into our big puddle that we just made. How are you doing there, Daniel? Daniel, you cutting? Let me see you cutting. Let me see. <laughs> oh, you got your left scissors. Left I, I, hand scissors. Yeah, I gave you left hand scissors, so make sure you put them in your left hand, okay? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. We got special scissors for Daniel. Yeah. We're gonna Aww. take a picture of Laura Cerise. We love you too. All right, Moshe's cutting out his boots so nicely. All right. Oh, there you are, Grace and Bennett. I missed your face. You finally. Okay. All right, now glue your. Now he's gonna glue his boots. Can I have one of your you're oranges, gonna, please? You're, you're gonna put the glue on the white side so that you can see your colorful rain boots when you glue them on. That's a lot. All right, Mosh. <laughs> too, too big. We got too many puddles of glue here. You don't for our rain boots. You don't. Uh, yeah, you don't need to draw on your paper and glue. Just a little bit will suffice. So necessary. We're gonna play our rain song again. Oh, look, turn it over so they're nice and beautiful. Turn it over, there we go. 
All right, look at Moshe. He's got his boots stepping in his puddle. Look how cool, so cool. Okay, so while you're doing that, I actually wanted to read you another story. Because I know, because I love the rain and tomorrow we're gonna start something else. So this is called Rainy Day Alphabet Book. So while you're finishing your project, you can listen to the story. Okay, thank you so much, Moshe, for helping us today. This is called Rainy Day Alphabet Book. On rainy days, we eat apples that start with A. We blow bubbles that start with B. We color cats that start with C. And we dance that starts with D. We eat eggs that start with E. We feed our fish that starts with F. We play guitar that starts with G. And we hide that starts with H. If you watch my episode today, you will see that we're gonna be focusing on the letter H. So tune in later on YouTube for the letter H. We eat ice cream that starts with I. We play jacks that starts with J. We kiss our kitten that starts with K. We lie on a lap that starts with L. We make a mess that starts with M, M, -m mess. We nibble nuts that starts with N. We eat oranges that starts with, what does oranges start with? Huh? Do you know, Grace and Bennett, what oranges starts with? It starts with O, and we play in puddles that starts with P. We rest on a quilt that starts with Q. We read rhymes that starts with R. We sing songs that starts with S. And we touch our toes that starts with T. We use umbrellas that starts with U. We visit the violets that starts with V. We watch the weather that starts with W. We make X's and O's. We play with yo-yos that starts with Y, and we zip our zippers that starts with Z. And everybody in today's packet, you had this. So hopefully later you can go with your family on a nature hunt in your backyard, in the park, around your neighborhood, in your grandma's yard, wherever you want. You go outside and try to find all these things and whichever one you find, you can put an X on them or a circle around it so you know that you found it. All right, guys, have a great day. Look out for our YouTube later. I love you so much. Bye, everyone. We love That's you. Sarah Sarit saying goodbye. I love you. I miss I'm going to unmute you for a second so you can talk to your friends. All right, let's. Okay, everybody say hi to your friends. I love you. I love, you. I love you so much. Hello, can I